So he's played a detective, a lawyer, and a farmhand in the past, but now actor Ian Kelsey is turning his attention to medical matters. Yes, he's starring in the BBC One daytime drama Doctors, where he's taking over as the rather unpopular manager of the surgery, keeping the doctors in check. It's not the first time he's played a medical role. You might also remember him from Casualty. We'll talk to Ian in just a moment. First, let's take a look at him in action, ruffling the feathers of his new colleagues at the practice. What are you all doing here? I was asked us in early. Oh, you didn't ask us. Wish you didn't ask me. I'm only here to make sure my husband keeps his job. Your husband can hear you. Ah, oh, good. Everybody's here. And early too. Excellent. Trouble is, I can't tell if he's being sarcastic or not. Team, I'd like to say a few words. Today is a new beginning. A new beginning, not just for me, who's privileged to lead this team, but a new beginning for the mill. A glorious new beginning. Very Churchill. Winston or the dog? But that glory has to be earned. The dog? It's going to be hard. We all have to bring our air games. But I have faith in every one of you. Thank you. Ready to bring your air game? Uh, I'm sorry I don't speak imbecile. Oh, don't rock the boat, not today. If we have a quick chat in my office. I have a special task for you. It's insufferable. What were you thinking of? I know he's got a... Yeah, look. It's nerves over the reaccreditation. After today, things will settle down. Ian's here now. Very good morning. Good morning. Good morning. He's he's uh, causing a few problems, isn't he? Already. Yes. What's the idea? He's kind of military man. Yeah, and he's, he's come he's, in and he's, his background's military. Um, and f when he left the army, he went to work for um, the National Health Service. And um, he's decided to get his hands dirty again. I think he, he just wants to get, get himself out there and get people under him again. Um, and um, he's doing that and ruffling a lot, a lot of feathers. But um, it was, his character is actually based on a real person who left the army, went to work for the NHS, and then went to take over a doctor's practice. And um, three of the staff, this is in Birmingham, three of the staff resigned uh, because... Within a week um, or something, wasn't it? Yeah, well, I don't, I can't, I don't know time. what the story is, yeah. But they all resigned because he was, they was treating them like they were his privates. OK, so I suppose we're going to see fireworks, are we, then? Yes. Yeah. Sorry, yes, yes, yes. Um, yeah, it's all going on. Um, yeah, I think there's um, you know, something happening next week, which you probably can't say. But, um, do, you, do, you, oh. do you record a long time in advance? Yeah, we do, actually. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's been quite mad. I've been on the gig now for, uh, for three months, and I've been kind of used to doing the work now. And then just this week, uh, you know, I'm on telly um, as well, so there's that element which has come back into it, which is quite strange. But yeah, three months is is quite quite far. Well, I was going to ask you how you're going to handle the, the GP strike, <laughs> but clearly that's not <laughs> yes. going to affect you. Yeah. <laughs> You'll make them all well, work. They do. They, I mean, they, they're up against it, the writers, because things, you know, they have to keep it true to life. And um, I'm I'm quite nervous and keeping my eye on you guys for the day that you say practice managers will be um, taken out of the system. Mm. That means yes. I'll be out of a job. Great, we've got one more viewer. That's fantastic. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and what's it like joining us? Because so, it's been going some years now, isn't it? So they're yeah. a pretty, I imagine, they're a pretty tight-knit group already, aren't they? Yeah, it's, it's really nice. It's, um, it's an environment that I've been used to, you know, working on Emmerdale and Casualty, doing the long-running stuff. Um, and it's just really nice to kind of come back into this environment. You get to know the crew, you get to know the cast, and it's, it's hard work, the long, long old days, you know. Um, but... Um, I'm really enjoying it, really enjoying it. I'm, I'm actually getting this thing which I called Howard Back, which is, um, I was just seeing with, with his character, you know, I've kind of made him kind of walk in a certain way and stand in a certain way. So if I'm doing a 12 hour day, I, I get Howard Back because you need I'm to see kind a of. Doctor. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Plenty of you, so you were in casualty before and you yes. played a doctor then? Yeah, I played a doctor then. He's a practice, this guy's a practice yeah. manager. So. Do you have that thing, I mean, Adam was mentioning, you know, the, the reaction from people he gets now. D did you get that thing? I know some casualty Hobby City doctors get the thing where people come up and tell them about their ailments. No, I never got that. Didn't <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I mean, they, they, they didn't like his character much, but people like to not like somebody. I think it's quite nice, that. But, um, I, no, I haven't really got that. You do get recognised, and it depends where you go in the country. You'll get recognised for different programmes, you know. Like, if I go anywhere north of Nottingham, I'll just get clocked for Emmerdale stuff, you of know. Of course. 
Of course. Yes. Um, so yeah, so uh, so working quite it's quite hard work, isn't it, doing a soap and doing that many episodes as well? Yeah, yeah. Um, at, at any one point, I think. It, uh, at this point now, I've got seven episodes in your head. In my head, while well, I was trying to put them in my head last night, but it wasn't happening. But, um, do you want them to come out in the wrong order, do you? No. <laughs> that's a lot. That's a lot of script. Yeah, it's. I mean, um, I haven't done this sort of work for for nearly two or three years now, and um, I, I knew I could do it. So when I started on this, it, it took about a month for my short-term memory to, to kind of get going again. Mm. It's a muscle, and if you haven't used it for a while, it's just like you, you haven't been going to the gym. So you do kind of have a look, and it's like, right, you know. And if it's, it's not literally written in your hand, though. It has been, no. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. Uh, lovely to see you this morning. Good luck. Very good luck yes. with that. Thanks for coming to see us. Cool. Uh, you can see Doctors on BBC One every weekday, I'm sure you know that, at 1.45pm. And mid will be with us in just a few minutes' time. Yes, first though, here's a quite last quick look at what is happening where you are.